Now, I talked about my top three most disappointing albums for 2016, and I said that those albums weren't necessarily bad albums. These are the worst albums. These are the absolute worst of 2016. Some of these albums just made me absolutely infuriated. I mean, these are bad. These are these are albums that don't really have any redeeming qualities, should not be listened to, avoid at all cost. Here are the top three worst albums of 2016. Number three. Number three is Simple Plan with Taking One for the Team. I certainly took one for the team by listening to this album and reviewing it. These are guys in their 40s who are still just whining about teenage angst and, and girl problems. It, does, it just comes off as whiny and entitled and it's just obnoxious. Everything about this album is just terrible. It, it just doesn't sound like it was done with any kind of interest. The, the music itself is infuriating as well. It's either It ranges from just simplistic to just awful. There's no talent behind this. It, it really just needs to be avoided. Number two. Number two is 6AM with Prayers for the Damned. This is another album that avoid at all costs. I mean, I, I just feel like... These guys need to get over themselves. A lot of these things they're talking about, fighting through things, and you're not going to keep me down. They just sound so disingenuous when they're coming from rock stars at this point. And I'm sure that's something that appeals to people, but it just does not work for me. And on top of that, the music itself is pretty bad. There's no, there's no interesting guitar work or anything I can kind of talk about to kind of say, well, at least it had this. It really doesn't have anything that is worth mentioning. Uh, I mean, the vocal work even, and I, I'm not a, I'm not opposed to Nikki Six's voice. I just, it just doesn't really suit this album. And especially when you had talk about the subject matter, it just all falls apart. This album is damned. Number one. If you follow this channel, you saw this coming. Number one, the worst album of 2016, Attila's Chaos. Holy shit, this album, this album just takes the cake of being bad. Their, their last album, Proving Grounds, just really made me angry. This album just makes me want to take it and chuck it at somebody's head who I hate. There is nothing going on in this album that's good. The the vocal work is terrible on this. I mean, he does a decent job with his growls, but nothing that is anything we haven't heard before. The guitar work is just utterly simplistic most of the time. The drumming is just not that good. There's nothing special about it. It just follows a set pattern. The songs follow a set pattern. The lyrics are just so cringeworthy that you just can't believe that these guys are writing this down and thinking, oh, this sounds good. This is cool. I'm going to talk about this. It's it's misogynistic. It's juvenile. It's awful. They need to get over themselves. They need to realize that they suck as a band. I'm sorry. I don't normally say things like that, but Attila are just fucking terrible. I do not like them. I think they do a terrible job at their music. This album, Chaos... No. Thank you so much for watching. Those were my top three worst albums of 2016. Again, let me know what you think down below. Did you agree with me? Do you like these albums? Let me know. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more.